What's up, Scorpio? Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future. The situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it, I need to. Also remember, it's a general reading. So just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. Also, if you guys like to contact me for a personal reading, that information is below as well. Um, also, I'm just going to offer a limited number of immediate futures for um, $10. So if you're interested in that, um, just send me an email below. All right, immediate future for Scorpio, please. <laughs> My baby sleep. Sleep so weird. It always comes up here. It's cool, but sometimes it just knocks everything over. Big baby. He gets on all my stuff. Yeah, here he says, Ooh, you got a lot of love around you. Could be dating someone new. Could be uh, just going out, celebrating something. You could be meeting someone while you're like out with friends or like an event, a dinner, something like that. Because you got a whole lot of love and then you're ending with the Ten of Pentacles. So love, commitment, stability, things like that. This is real though. And it could be something that's brand new. Could just be having a good ass time. Show me that Three of Cups please for Scorpio. Woo! Ten of Cups. Heart is content here, whoever you're around. So like I said, the three of cups, you could be dating. You could be reconciling with somebody. Aquarius energy is something that you hoped for, something that you waited for. It could be something that was at it or someone that was at a distance. But also, um, it's oh, it's very intimidated by you, possibly financially. But um it's kind of something that's it's at a three. If you think of a scale of one to three, it looks like something that may have already developed some type of initial success, but hasn't really took off. I mean, you could just be, you know, traveling a distance and uh, hanging out with friends. All right, show me this Ace of Cups because this is where, yeah, I don't even know if you still see this right now. Actually, you could work with this person. For some, it could be a new job, a new career that you're starting, and you're definitely loving it. It could be like a dream job, but I mean, the Ace of Cups does represent a whole lot of, you know, love and emotions, things like that. Right now, it doesn't look like it's exactly visible, or you may not just be open to it. But it looks like the work, the effort is put in, and a lot of happiness comes from that. Like I said, if it's around a job, money is really coming coming from it. Show me that Ten of Pentacles for Scorpio. But even if it's around relationship, you know, it is possible that you work with this person. But um, this is, you know, working on something that's stable, that's long term. And then there comes those swords. There comes that worry. The mind plays tricks on us because that right there is anxiety. Just take it slow. Take it day by day. Yeah. I mean, it takes a lot of... Okay. So with the devil. Capricorn energy. Don't hold on to anything that's like 
unhealthy from your past, like any type of unhealthy attachments. However, it feels like this could also be kind of, I mean, sometimes with the devil, we can self-sabotage on, on one side because it looks like things are, like there's a lot of security here, like a lot of foundation. This can even be money, things paying off. It does require a lot of work, a lot of effort. And sometimes, especially with this nine of swords here, we can worry about shit. And then that creates like even more of a, I don't know, makes things seem a little harder than they have to be. So try, try to stay out of your head and see things clearly. I'm going to clarify this devil because at the same time you have the careful what you wish for energy. So why is the devil there? Because whatever this is, it does take effort. Um, if this is like a past person who is non-committal, maybe younger, in and out, that's popping up. So why the devil? The nine of wands. All right. So also, um, with the devil, there could have been like some type of addictions or negative behavior pattern. Something like something that happened in the past has to be moved past. And that's kind of what somebody is struggling with. With the Nine of Wands, it's like down but not out. So, I mean, the King of Wands, some, that could be ego, pride that always makes somebody walk away. Somebody having to be in the spotlight. It can also be somebody's pride, like, holds things back. Give me one more for the devil, please. Yeah, the Magician. Manifest exact set your intentions on what exactly it is that you're trying to manifest take your time take this day by day look at things from all perspectives and don't hold on to things that's going to just hold you back because you have the power to manifest this let's see yeah i mean it's happening in the in divine timing take your time plant those time and energy you know plant those seeds whatever's done let it go. Look for that new new. Can I get love or oracle for Scorpio? If this is around work, then just stay out of your head. It could be, you know, a job at a big firm, but also um, stay out of your head. Look at things from all perspectives because it is like a slow moving energy. But around love, I don't like that devil popping up. So show me ones around love heartbroken, deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, feeling lost, grieving and mourning. And, and then you also have kisses, unconditionally loving, giving and receiving affection, falling in love, and healing heart, healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. So you do have... You know, it could be that somebody has just got some shit they got to get over or they're, they're, you know, dealing with in their own lives. And it may not even be between you two because heartbroken and healing heart. But then you do have something new that's, you know, popping up there with the, the Ace of Cups, the Chaser, Chaser in a codependent relationship, fear, uh, uh, sorry, fear of abandonment issues. So just kind of take that one how it resonates. If it's a past person or somebody goes in and out, the acts, break up, separation, stop the pattern, silent treatment, and abandonment. The past doesn't seem like it's changed or is still dealing with something. Stabbed in the back, heartbreak, pain, separation, deception, shocking attack. Yeah. All right, Scorpio, I hope this helps. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys like to contact me for a personal reading or for the $10 uh, media future or just see where the energy is around you, where things are headed, just uh, send me an email to the email at the email address below. All right, you guys take care and I'll see you next time.